Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Diablo 3 speedruns. Today, we are on Act 3. If anything, I might do Act 4 at the same time, but I figure it's probably better to keep them in separate videos. Uh, I actually just spent the last couple moments trying to mm, change my skills. <laughs> so, Act 3 isn't too bad. It's probably one of my favorite acts, actually. Granite's it's full of, uh, <laughs> it's full of monsters, so the frame rate's probably going to suck for a little while here. Shush, Asmodon. So speaking of Asmodon, that's actually one of the things that, um, that is mockable in this act, is that Asmodon se uh, tends to, uh, well, he's an idiot. Let's go with that. He constantly mocks you, you know, pointlessly of, like, oh, my army is, you know, demolishing you, blah, 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 blah. And, wow, frames, really? Alright, give it a second here. Like I said, this act is going to probably suck ass for that. Um, I'll be trying my best to just teleport my way there up until my thing fails me. And actually, I'll oh, grab my... We're gonna switch this to, uh, yeah, start going we should do it pretty nicely. Ugh, alright. Stark winner, come on. Kill some stuff. <laughs> I can't do anything with my frames in doing that, so. Kill everything real quick. Kill that guy. Beautiful. I might have to kill stuff along the way just to keep the frames down, so don't mind that. Oh, there's the first one. I almost ran past it. So something I'll show you in a second here once we get past all this crap. Uh, lately I've been trying to... I've been trying to get past Hell Mode, and uh, there's actually a build I have to change my gear for it again, though. Um, but uh, how about this? Once we get to once we get to the end of this act, I'll use the remaining time for the video to uh, show you what the show you what it is. Oh, whoops! I didn't. <laughs> I didn't like the fire. Whoops. It's all right. I can run back real quick. Not too big of an issue. Kill stuff along the way. As I mentioned today, I really do need to to get my level up. I'm only 56. Not sure how far I was last time I made this video. Probably 56. It's getting kind of annoying. I'm really trying to aim for 60, but it's difficult. Um, as of late, there's been. I think I talked about this in my last speed run, but or maybe I talked about it in the review I tried to do. But um, there's been hacking happening, and the main issue is that a lot of people are saying that. Um, that, you know, the, oh, they don't, you know, they don't give out their info, blah, 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 and the, 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 the thing that's, that was going around was that the hack is, um, is happening, how can I say this? <sighs> Fucking die, damn it. People were saying that there was a hack out there that was allowing hackers to sign on to your account just by being on your recent, uh, friends list. Or your recent playlist, and they're able to just you know sign on to your account just by playing with you in a public game. And obviously, if that was possible, that's kind of fucking scary, <laughs> just a little bit. Um, it's a nice experience there, holy shit. So obviously, something like that is a little bit scary, and uh, so people were saying, don't play public games. Well, Bashiak, the was a community manager or something like that. He has said that they they're taking these uh you know they're taking this very seriously and they're looking into it. And what they found was that no account was taken over like that. You know, if people are getting hacked, it's because they're being fucking stupid. <laughs> it's that simple. So I mean, I, I was I was I was considering it this way. 
and obviously this hat, you know, when somebody pops in and says, oh, I've never given my info to anyone, blah, 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 everyone goes, uh, yeah, you're full of shit. And so, I mean, I was thinking the same thing, is no one's got my password. You know, it, okay, my password's not the hardest, but, you know, no one knows my password anymore. I've made sure of that. So, if I were to get hacked, for people to say, oh, I gave my password out, uh, no. <laughs> I don't do it. I don't give my password out to anybody. It'd be stupid. Um, like I said, though, you know, obviously everyone says that. Shut up, Asmodon. No one cares. So that was the big thing, but as Batchy, like I said, uh, he said there's basically no reason to fear public games. You know, people who have... The funny thing was that, um, right off the bat, people were saying, oh, well, I have an authenticator. So they're saying that these hackers were able to log in without the authenticator. Uh, so if you have an authenticator, it doesn't matter. But um, but it's funny is when Bashiak made the post, he said, although the, the authenticator is not 100% secure, at the same time, all these people that are claiming to have been hacked, they don't have one. <laughs> so I mean, it's it, it's just I, don't know, I just find it kind of funny. And of course, the conspiracy of you know, oh. Blizzard's doing the hacking so that they can, you know, convince people to to buy an authenticator. And it's like, to be fair, you don't need to buy an authenticator. You, if you have a smartphone, it works on that as well. But, uh, personally, I don't really care for authenticators. Um, it just, I don't know, it just seems kind of pointless to me. I tried to get one, but, um, the email that is on my phone, I try to change it, um, I added the I added the email on my phone that is associated with this Blizzard account. It uh, for some reason just didn't work. I don't know why. So the authenticator I guess would not work for me. Um, at least not on the smartphone. But hey, I was considering buying one anyway because they're kind of cool looking. Um, to me, I, I see them as they're very fucking useful. I don't know why. Oh, I don't know why anyone would not have one. Wow, frames really. That's just terrible. So that's the problem is that when my frame rate fails like that, I can only get one fucking teleport in. Ridiculous. Okay, this is getting stupid. Yep, you're dead. You're dead. I still have Archon, by the way, because of the bosses, but don't really think I need it anymore. Where the hell am I even going? I think I'm supposed to, yeah, I'm supposed to go down there. That's my bad. That guy's dead. I have fire weapon, don't I? I think I do. Oh well. So now we're trying to get to the catapults with my nice frame rate. Yay! <laughs> it's like fucking 10 right now. It's ridiculous. I'm just gonna teleport this way. All this crap. Alright. Oh, and even funnier thing was somebody, uh, somebody posted a topic saying, oh, yeah, you know, I, I did a speedrun of Act 1 in, like, three hours or an hour, or, it was three or four hours or something like that, and, uh, I just fucking laughed, because I figure he meant, you know, starting brand new, obviously, which still isn't all that hard, the issue really would be the final boss. But I just laughed, because someone, because you guys like, oh, can you beat that? I'm like... Uh, yeah, I've got a video of me doing it in 45 minutes. <laughs> I could probably do it faster, too. Uh, the real, Like I said, the real issue with uh, with Act 1 is all the different dungeons that are in it. Yeah, you gotta get really lucky. Uh, with this portion, it's pretty simple. Uh, keep these guys safe. Nothing more to it. You know, being a level 56 is pretty fucking easy. Zap. I tend to just cast out blizzards. They'll jump into it and die. See? Easy. It takes so fucking long, it's kind of annoying. Take that health potion. Or globe. And it's on the uh, second catapult that I love, and you'll see why. Um, toss out a couple blizzards here. Get my wings on.
<laughs> Who knows, I might level during this. Yay. Come on. I have arcane, okay, not bad. 16,000 health, nice. Gotta lower that, of course. Yes, I do. Alright. We're basically done here. So we gotta move on. Look at that. Get rid of those. So the second catapult up here is very nice. And you'll see why pretty quickly. Try best to save those guys. Yeah, you are. Because you fail. Alright, second catapult. I hate the third catapult, it's annoying as hell, but this one's very simple. Basically, while they're trying to do this, these things will pop up. So, kill them. It's pretty simple, right? I do love seeing those things at the bottom, though. It's awesome. And once those are down, you should be done. <laughs> From what I noticed, uh, they tend to stop attacking after that one, after they come up each time. So, um, so this is actually the gear that I've been using, and the I'll show you at the very end, of course, what it's used for. It's a really cool, uh, it's a really cool build, and it's fucking. Once I get the right gear, um, I gotta get gear for. See so what was it? A uh, health regen. That's what it was. You gotta get a lot of health regen, and it's a really fucking awesome uh, build. Like once you once you understand what it can do, your first thought is holy fuck. Nicely done. Alright. This is the one I hate. Yeah, he's alone. Basically, we have to, uh... We just have to keep hitting this. Um, obviously a lot easier to do when you're with somebody. But I just wait for it to be clickable. Click it. Kill the things, maybe. I should have an achievement for, uh... This guy never telling you off. Because if you stop doing it for a second, he'll kind of yell at you. <laughs> so I mean, they should—they really should have an achievement for guy doesn't yell at you at all. Basically, means you kept hitting the thing. Either way, it's pretty easy to do. There we go. We are done. Wait for him to talk. Temper. Do me a favor and don't mention that I shouted at you a little, alright? <laughs> alright, come on. Come on, framed. Come on, come on, come on. Don't be an ass. Let's do this. There you go. Fuck off. Alright, off to the keep. You're good to go. <laughs> Alright. The depths. Fun place. Fun times. What's up? Alright, sadly you can't teleport past walls like you used to be able to in Diablo 2. If that's the one thing I miss about teleport, or if there's one thing I miss about teleport, is that you cannot teleport through walls like you used to be able to. Um, not that I've been, been able to see. Um, if there's a door in the way, you can teleport past that, I believe. But, uh, like actual walls, no. Kill everything here real quick. Um. Maybe you can't. Okay, that one was an unbreakable door, that's probably why. <laughs> They've got really weird ways to do it in this game. But, 
that big issue. I don't like teleporting in these areas anyway, uh, as much anyway. Only. Oop. Daily should do more damage. Zap everything to death. Keep on running. You're dead. You're dead. Whoa. You're all screwed. So you kind of got to aim yourself through the doors. It's really kind of bothersome. Um... So it doesn't look like it'd be over there. Hello. Where, oh, where would you be? Not this way, apparently. Yeah, I got stuck in a wall. Go me. Uh, do, 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 do. I'm not sure where they put this one. Ooh, a chest. Dead, you're dead, you're dead. You? This might be where it's at. Fuck off. Ooh, treasure gamma. Huh. There's you again. Don't care about you. Uh, might be this way then. Main part of these in this area to get to this one. Yep, let's find the lava. I always search for the lava. You'll find your way to the level two pretty soon after that. All right. Now, where am I going? Oh, I hate these little fuckers. Yeah, that's what you get for trying to attack me, pal. Get everything over there real quick. Indeed, I am. Alright. Not so tough now. What the hell is that, Jimin? Kill 50 champions of the following times. Cool. Cool. I got an achievement, people. Yay. Um. Ooh, fun stuff. You're all dead. And then, yeah, once you get to this area, this is where you, uh... This is where you just look for the ice part. Those snowy parts. And you'll be there pretty quick as well. i pass all this shit. Hello. Obviously, they don't do much here, but damn it. Even at nightmare mode, those guys can be a bitch to deal with. Um, where the hell am I going? Fuck off. There we go. You're too late. Blah, blah, blah. This is the part that people don't like is... You know, the server's already inside your walls. Blah, blah, blah. I'm so cocky. And then you kill all the server. And he's like, ah, whatever. He was terrible anyway. He was boring. And the whole time you're just like... That's about you're failing. <laughs> don't know what else to say, but you suck. And... Oh, there we go. Hello. You're dead. Oh, yep, yeah, way the fuck over there. Figures. Now I screw this part up. I'm not gonna bother with that one. Oh yeah, lost quite a bit of money too. Bought all my gear, and uh, actually we can talk about the auction house. They actually delayed the the real money auction house that everyone was freaking out about. Um, personally, I see it as a good thing that they delayed it because, well, one because of the uh, the supposed hacking of late. Um, 
as, as I think if the hacking actually was done, you know, because people are fucking retarded and giving out their info, then, you know, that's their fault. But if the hacking is, you know, something that everyone could be affected by, like, I know some people that straight up cannot be hacked. Like, they don't give out their info, they have the most secure possible, you know, uh, passwords. Like, my brother, he's got, um, a randomizer for his passwords, from what I recall, and basically he's got, you know, 30 fucking character passwords that you'll never fucking figure out, which is straight up awesome. <laughs> So, I mean, you know, there's, there are some people that just cannot be hacked. Or at least not by, you know, regular hackers. Not even gonna bother with Harkon for this guy. It's not worth it. Yeah, I was not a fan of that boss right off the bat anyway. I earned crop dusting. What the hell is crop dusting? Yeah, yeah, fucking has been done. Terrifying noises have happened recently. Uh, I'll kill Gon without getting hit by his gas attack. Naturally. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to do that, but that'll work too, I guess. My frame rate doesn't really matter. She goes crazy and kills stuff. End of cutscene. Then we gotta kill these little guys. Yay. So it's on something, something. Go through the area gate. Can't wait to do the Let's Play. I can actually listen to all this stuff. I've actually missed quite a bit of story because of, uh... You know, the people that I play with just... They didn't really pay attention. Well, like, I wouldn't pay attention just in case... Damn it! I've done that twice now. Fuck. Fuck, fuck. I gotta walk all the fucking way around. Fuck off, you prick. Yeah, I never really listened to the story because a lot of people just, a lot of people would skip it and whatnot. Uh, when I was going through Act Three, I was with this guy that I stayed with him because he was good, and so I was like, "Fuck it, you know, I wanna, I wanna be able to be with someone who can actually do stuff." And uh, he skipped a lot of shit. Kind of annoyed by it. All right, my friend's probably gonna fail right here too. No, oh, well. I am. Exactly what he said. I'm gonna wait to use my teleport here so I can talk to the guy up here. Hello. Across the bridge of Kolsik. That should be out here. Walk into the frozen rain. That's a smart idea. There's actually some, there's a monster here that I really fucking hate. Most annoying fucking things possible. Thank you, Blizzard, for creating them, you assholes. Goddamn fucking teleport. Can't teleport through a friggin' rock. Piece of shit. Ooh, protection shrine. I need that. Only way for teleport here. I can teleport through debris, though. I call all the bridges have collapsed the same way too in this game. <laughs> that was an interesting little thing I noticed. Alright, kill these guys real quick. Cross the bridge. Fuck off, you fucking knockback and pieces of shit. Go, 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 go. Yeah, those fucking things. I fucking hate them. The little poisonous arm bullshit. Annoying as hell. Alright, where am I going here? Destroying that. Okay, you know what? Now you're just pissing me off. Oh my god, the fucking knockback? Are you serious? Fuck off, all of you. God damn. Fuck off with your fucking knockback. Oh my god, I'm gonna kick your ass. Fucking knockbacking whores. Fuck all of you. Good god. No, I'm killing everything. I can speedrun the rest of this still. 
But these knockbacking assholes need to fucking learn their fucking place. Knock back me three goddamn times in a row. How dare you? How fucking dare you? I don't even care about that guy. He's just gonna spawn shit on you anyway. You're all dead. Oh, there's the other one. That's what we're going for. Um, hey, knock back again. That's cool. Fuck you. I should have gotten the uh, Archon with friggin' teleport. Oh, that's the one in the middle. I don't gotta work. Fuck off. Fuck off. So basically, with this, you gotta just get kills to to uh, keep Archon going. Not too difficult, really. Oh, cool! You knocked me back. How about you die, whore. A couple more seconds. Always helpful. Uh, where's the third one? There it is. There we go. Booyah. Yeah, see? He doesn't need the stuff that I just destroyed? Hell no. That's why he said that he was going to win because he has all that stuff, right? That's probably what he said anyway. So you stand in the middle of my army of hell, it will crush you. And then I destroyed the army of hell that was going to crush me. And suddenly he doesn't need that anymore either. <laughs> you can see why people were kind of annoyed with him. He's just, he's a cocky motherfucker. When well, he really shouldn't be. Alright, just teleport past this part. Best we can. Probably gonna have to kill stuff anyway. We got a boss coming up here very soon. I cannot wait for him. Like I said earlier, if, uh, with Archon mode, since you're able to prolong it, constantly um, basically if you're able to keep it for like three minutes straight because there's a constant wave of enemies like here then, oh fuck that guy then uh, by the time you are out of our combo you can get right back into it again so the the uh, cooldown doesn't start until or the, yeah the cooldown starts right off the bat it doesn't wait until you're out of Archon mode for the first time which is really awesome I was very excited about that did you really just knock me nowhere? Well, fuck you too, you fat piece of shit. Ah, uh, no, you're gonna die. That sucks. I can move. I can actually teleport. You wanna see? Watch. See, maybe if you were magic, you wouldn't be on the ground dying. Just a thought. So this crappy barricade. Sorry, this crappy barricade here. Debris. Ooh, a pointless chest. How interesting. Fuck off. Don't fucking knock me back again, I swear to god. I'll kill all- Really? I just teleported into a f Oh wow. Small little rock protected- That's just bullshit. Ooh, another nice add-on. Deals with those. Uh, no longer is it just- I think wasn't it always just one person who got those when you, when you clicked on them for like more experience or whatever. Um, now anyone who's nearby, any teammates who are nearby will get the thing as well. And they stack. No longer do you, you know, get the experience one and then accidentally uh, get rid of it for, um, for you know, mana regen or something. Nope, they all stack. Or as far as I can tell, you can have infinite of them stacking. Find that infinite because you can't find that. I can't find that many in the game, but you get my point. Oops, teleport into nothingness again. Nothing as hell. Yeah, Act 3 is amazing. <laughs> lots of... Lots of enemies to kill. If I recall, this is actually the act that you use to farm shit. I might be wrong, though. Sorry, I was... Doing something. Oh no, however, will I kill you? There's no fucking possible way that I can kill you. Oh. Never mind. I guess I can. Take it easy. Alright, another uh, cutscene, I think. Not anymore. Oh boy. This part. I love these things. It's nice experience and some failure on latency. 
This seems annoying because there's so fucking many of them. They get in the way. But try your best to teleport through the level if you can. Destroy those because that will summon more shit probably. And this is a dead end. So we gotta go through this way. Kill the fat tough crap there. Lay down a blizzard just in case. And go this way. Hey! I'm getting more fucking. What the fuck did I get this time? Uh, kill 1500 elite. Sweet. Getting so many achievements in just this run through. I'm so happy. I think it matters, but still, I'm happy. Oh crap. And actually, I can show you guys a very cool way to level up in this game. Once we get there, of course. It's gonna be around the end of the fucking thing, but. Yeah, so worth seeing. Um, hell, I'll probably do it once I'm done with this. Uh, once I'm done with this speed run, because I'm close to leveling, and my way of leveling will probably do it for me. Do I go this way? No, I do not. I wasted a teleport. Go me. I got things following me. I don't like it. Go away. You get destroyed. You too. Any more time still. Great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nephilim does Nephilim. Well, you know what I've always been annoyed by? Why are we Nephilim now? Now, I figure it's because the World Stone's gone. Maybe they're calling us Nephilim because of that now. Because Diablo causes Nephilim too. Spoiler alert. He causes Nephilim constantly as well. Um, I don't think Belial ever caught us that. Oh, yeah. The Tower of the Dams. Uh, pretty easy to get through. They're pretty straightforward, actually. <laughs> Um, that means no one asked that uh, on GameFAQ server, not that I saw, but it's like both Asmodon and Diablo constantly call you Nephilim. And to be honest, I think it's because the world soon got destroyed, so now, you know, humans are getting their power back. Um, slowly, obviously, but they're still getting their power back. Um, the Wizard is actually the prime example of that. Uh, for those of you who don't know, it, well, for people who aren't, you know, story savvy with Diablo, um, Diablo 2, Lord of Destruction, ended 20 years ago, and the wizard was born right after the destruction of the World Stone. Imagine that. So, technically, she would be the like, first generation of new Nephilim. Um, and Nephilim have the power to basically be gods, which is pretty damn awesome. It's, uh, I haven't read the Sin War books fully, um, but I read the wiki on them, so I was happy. But uh, basically, the main guy, I mean, he's, he had such power. He was able to will a demon into nothingness. And we're talking not just any demon, but uh, what was it Mephisto's son, I think it was? They just willed him into nothingness, and he vanished. You know, wasn't even, doesn't exist anymore. And that's just fucking amazing. That's the power of Nephilim. So I mean, we're basically gods. I'm happy with this. So I laugh when, you know, like, you got friggin', uh, Asmodon and Diablo think they can do anything to us. It's like, nope, you guys are screwed. Just bend over and take it like a man. Nope, die. And there's our way out. Heart of the Damned. Find the Sin Heart. Where's that spider lady? I, think she, I don't think she appears unless you're at the top still. Yeah, these, these monsters right here, these hulking phase douchebags, they are annoying as hell. They they always, they have the ability to teleport instantly. Like, it's just a natural ability of theirs. <laughs> so, them having teleport is kind of funny. <laughs> but uh, it's just annoying, it's like, I always thought it was a, reg a different, I thought it was just a, you know, ability they got, you know, commonly or something. But no, it's just their normal ability. So if you ever, f oh yeah, of course. Don't worry, she'll run away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're super fun. Blah blah blah. Oh, there goes the sin heart. Oh well. Yeah, you can't kill her there anyway, but. Oh yeah, but hey, to be fair, she is the center boss, so she's one of the bosses that uh. They are able to kill before she runs away. 
Isabel is a different story. Same with that fucking butterfly bitch. Alright, where are we now? Uh, so we got a few towers to go through, I think. Gotta get through this crap. No, they did not. So why I like this place is it's very, very, very straightforward. I mean, they, they don't have many dead ends here that I know of. Fuck off. You fuck off, too. Trying to get my teleport back. These things I hate so goddamn much. Alright, teleport, teleport, teleport. Um, it should be this way. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Not in the mood for you. Any hey, more experience? No. Nope. Don't think so. You're all gonna die. Yeah, definitely the farming level. I'll have to remember that. Of course, I'm only... I'm not here yet for hell mode. Holy motherfucker. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> I hate those. Those things... Am I the only one that... The, 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 the tongue guys? The, these guys? Am I the only one that thinks Resident Evil when I see those motherfuckers? Seriously. They look exactly like them. They have the long fucking tongues. I hate to say this, but... Blizzard, you stole that from Resident Evil. Hmm. I'm kind of disappointed, actually. Those little fuckers are annoying, too. Oh, pro tip. You cannot teleport down. Like, when you're able to see the door. I've tried. <laughs> I thought, hey, I can skip, you know, a minute worth of running and teleporting by just teleporting down to the fucking door that I can see. No. Uh, Blizzard said, fuck you. See, look, you're able to see it right there. You can see the stairs and everything, but you can't teleport there. No. Kind of sad, to be honest. But it made speedruns a lot more quick. That would have made me happy. No, well. We'll move on. We'll kill these things. Oh, God. Thankfully, it doesn't take too long to get down here. And is this the... No, this is just level two. Damn. I think we gotta go down one more level. Should be. Yes, sir. -y. One more level. Yay for you. Why don't I remember this part? I really don't remember this part. Hmm. Or at least not that. Oh, hello. Little goblin, you're dead. I don't know why you bother running from me. You're fucked. Why are you following me, man? Go away. I don't like you. I know that that door is kind of annoying, isn't it? So you think, oh, it's right there. Why did I? Why am I not running to it? No, you gotta run the fucking way around. Goddamn game is annoying. It's all good. We're at the heart of the cursed. This guy's still gonna be with me. Oh, thank God. How does he find his way out? I didn't help him. The hell. All right, we're gonna go archon mode on her though because uh, I don't trust my other skills to do it. <laughs> if someone, if someone brings up a good question. What the fuck are these things? Like, obviously they hold up this whole giant tower, but what are they? Why don't they? Why don't they fight? Can you imagine fighting something that monstrous? That'd be fucked up. Yeah, I've been looking forward to this too. I'll fucking die. Ooh, I actually got a yellow. Oh, right, Sinheart. Dead. That was easy. And these staircases are hard to, are actually decently easy to miss. Well, look at that, man. Imagine fighting those things. God damn, they could just step on you. All right, the core area. So this is where the uh, this is where the 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 easy leveling up comes in. So basically, what you do is you start this quest. I started on Nightmare because you get more experience on Nightmare. If you're able to do it Hell Mode and you're not level 60 at that point, go for it. Um, basically, once you start it, you go to the you know you have this uh, waypoint already, and you teleport up. It's really pretty easy, to be honest. Um, 
I think this is the, uh, this should be core of area that it is. But, uh, yep, this is it. And uh, try not to get stuck killing things like this. What you're supposed to do is just, just keep running. Just keep fucking running. And on a uh, nightmare mode, I get, what is it, like, 88,000? Well, it's not you know, a huge amount, but it's a good, like, bar of health for me. Or it was. See? We're already here. Heart of Sin. Really? That was one more. Oh, well. It works. But, of course, this isn't just all you do. I'll get into it in a second here. Um, so, here's Asmodon, everybody. Crazy-ass fucking Asmodon. Cocky son of a bitch, ain't he? Come on. Let's... Let's get to killing you with ease and whatnot, and la la la, you're dead. Any yellows? No, I figured. <laughs> Alright. Um. Alright, so after you kill him, you go to town. Cause you got, you know, you got the, you got the quest finished experience there. You go to town. You talk to this guy. He says random crap. You go to the armory. Simple, right? Pretty simple so far. Once in the armory, get to the door as fast as possible. I like to teleport. And then, boop. Skip this. And boom. You get more. And then you're done. And now, welcome to Act 4, everybody. So that is the speedrun for Act 3. Hopefully you had fun. I know I did. So enjoy, and we will be back with Act 4 speedrun later. Take it easy, guys.